There we go, some old boars, huh? You wanna fight? Yes, line up, line up. Even file line, please. Yep, single file, I mean, not even. What are you doing behind that tree, dum-dum? Oh, I'm behind the tree now, sorry guys. You will die, boar. Yes, yes, delicious, delicious. We will be eating a feast tonight of boar, old boar. They must taste better. Come here, dummies. Wah, wah, you will die, yes. Ah, perish, you fools. Sorry, wolf, I need to take your flax from you. You wanna fight? You wanna fight? You do wanna fight. Oh, it's just a fox. Duh. It was a waste of our time, it was. Uh, looked like somebody was in need of assistance up here. I just saw someone get an attack. I'll save you, even though you're running away and totally fine. Not today, wolf. You will die here. Ugh. Come on, you can- Oh, jeez, man, he's putting up a fight. <laughs> you're dead. Jerk. We saved our friends, of course, like the hero we are. Look at us. <laughs> Viking heroes. <laughs> There's some flax. All right, what is going on, everybody? My name is Notorious Crisco, and this is episode four, I believe, of Pax Day. If you enjoyed this video, Please take a moment and leave it a like it really does help me out on youtube get more people to see these videos if you have anything fun to talk about tips or tricks please leave them in the comment section below and then if you want to see any more packs there just more videos by me in general please go to my youtube notorious crisco hit the subscribe button and then hit the bell icon that way you're updated anytime that i post a new video but besides all that last we left off we had uh, just done a lot of grinding really and I think it's gonna be a little bit more of that today not too much though because I am going to um, try to get some combat status up you know um, I was just gifted uh, the sword you see in my number one slot as well as the Viking shield that you see in my number two slot as well as the wrought iron axe in my four slot um, by our dear, dear, dear friend Titus. So, to make him proud, uh, I want to get my combat with one-handed weapons and shields much, much higher. Um, I was contacted by the clan leader, and he asked me what my profession was going to be. And I've told him it's going to be blacksmithing, weaponsmithing, armor smithing, and uh, you know we'll we'll be sort of proficient at everything else as well. But those will be the main. The main skills I want to work on besides combat, I want to be the guy, you know, the blacksmithing guy, the combat blacksmithing like you see in animes and stuff. <laughs> so the best way to do that is to grind hard as well as fighting all the things, literally all the things. We're going to fight everything. I wonder just how many, uh, you know, quaffs we'll need to do to get up to like level seven or something along those lines. I see I see a lot of uh, crafting in our near future, but to uh, make sure that it's not boring for you guys, I am definitely gonna go and fight some things and stuff and things. And we'll probably work on our other skills, of course. Uh, we'll have to be doing some scavenging and stuff for herbs and whatnot. Uh, we don't have the alchemy set just yet or the cooking set just yet, but those will be the next uh, craftables that we want to get besides doors. I was able to make one door because Titus had also given me four hinges, which I learned uh, that if you just pick something up, um, like a craftable or something along those lines, that itself will grant you a recipe, which is pretty wild. I didn't know that that was a thing. Um, but yeah, he, he dropped some hinges and I grabbed them and then now I got uh, some extra some extra craftables. I think it, I think it gave me like seven or eight different recipes. Um, so that's actually awesome info. I did not know that. So we'll be grabbing all the stuff and all the things. And if anybody's got stuff that we don't have, we're going to ask him to let us pick it up. But let me get this done real quick. And then uh, we will go do something else. Let's go ahead and start making some of the armor. Right, right. Some of the armor. Okay, can we make these yet? No, still very hard. But we could try to make these. Yeah, I think we will try to make these. Let's try to make some primitive chain mail shoes. Wow, 107 of them. No kidding. We got to get at least 50, right? Like half, right? Wouldn't you say? Probably not. Oof, not looking so good off the bat there. Get up there. You can do it. Yeah, we made some. How about that? How about that? Nice, man. We're just going to keep trying to make these until we uh, eventually get the, the, instead of very hard, we'll just make it hard for the the primitive chainmail gloves too i think that'll be sweet 
man, like, how cool would it be to make, like, a rare weapon and people seek you out because you're the one that knows how to make the rare weapon? Because, uh, I mean, it's only so many people in the server, you know? And so if you became the best blacksmither, everybody would got to go to you if they don't want to work on it themselves. Because this is super time-consuming, you know? Super time-consuming. I think I, spelt, uh, I spent about uh, four hours just grinding out stuff uh, yesterday. Um, and today will be probably likely more of the same. It'll be totally worth it when we can make all the best gear for sure. I finally got my AC fixed, by the way, guys. Only took three weeks, but hey, I got it fixed. And now... I don't have to bake the whole time that I'm making these episodes. Cause man, I, I I mean, with the cooler I have on my PC, it's really, really nice. But still, I was just baking. Oh my gosh. Felt like I was gonna sweat for the rest of my life. It seemed ridiculous. Nice, we're up to level seven armor smithing. Look at us. Look at us making big moves. Big moves. We should go get some more iron ore here in the near future. If not uh, tin or uh, copper ore too. Oh, look at all the stuff on the ground. Sweet. I'm glad that you at least get some stuff back. That is really nice. Also, I think I want to make like little fence gates around the outside of our uh, outside of our patio there. I want to go up front. These are going to be the clan chests. Um, not only the clan chest, but anybody that needs gear, you know, since I'm going to be making so many, I, I feel like it would be a huge waste to not keep them. But at the same time, I mean, what are we ever going to do with all this stuff? <laughs> we already have level two gear. Maybe I should try to make the very hard. Yeah, let's try Let's try to make very hard stuff. Who knows? We might get super lucky, right? Might be super lucky. Oh, wow. Did I make them? No. Oh, look at us. We did make them. Oh, my gosh. Wow, we're freaking professionals, dude. So good at this game. Look at that. Get up there. Wow. We're doing a great job. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I did not think I'd see this much success with it. I thought maybe. Oh, there it goes. I just had to say something, didn't I? That's right. It's going to be worth the XP for sure. Man, what do I do with all the extra? I'm going to have to just, like, drop it in the river or something. I don't know. All right, so now we're going to make the shoes. Number two shoes. Yes, sirree. Yes, sirree, Bob. I wonder when we'll unlock this. I kind of thought that this would unlock with them. As long as it remains in one piece. Oh. Okay, hold on. I'll hold the front door, guys. Maybe I just need some leather bands. Let's put these all away. Boy, we're going to run out of space in no time flat. Huh. Is there a way to deconstruct things? I feel like there should be, right? Like a... a uh, deconstruct, uh, thingamajig. Deconstruction bench that deconstructs things. Oh, I'm such a fool. Ah, oh, look, we're losing some stuff behind. Hey, give me that. I want that bit. Uh, uh, right there. Give me that. All right. Well, shoot. So we need to get some cloth linen. So let's put all this wire away. Coarse linen cloth. Where would I, where would I do that? Over here? Yeah, yeah. Coarse linen string. We got a bunch of that stuff right now. Oh, that's rough linen string. I forgot that we made that. Okay, come here, you. Come hither away. Let's do this. Okay, coarse linen string. Let's actually do this one first. Get us a new recipe. You know what I'm saying? All right, so we got to wait. We got to wait for this stuff to get going. Okay, so it might be beneficial for us to have multiple looms as well. Let's go over here and just drop all this gear on the ground because it's kind of a waste of our time. All right, good. That's fine. That's what all do we need for that again. So for the pants, we'll need coarse linen cloth. For that, we will need coarse leather band as well as coarse linen cloth. Okay. All right, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to run up up northwest to the, uh, the iron area. We're going to go up there and then uh, at the same time, there's flax up there. So we'll try to get some flax as well as a little bit more iron. I accidentally put uh, both of our both of our iron creation on the same furnace like a fool, but it's all right. It'll be fine. Oh, this is a new house, isn't it? Oh, no. Oh, is that going to get rid of the freaking clay that stays there? Or is he going to have a monopoly on the clay, I wonder? Oh, I hope not. That would really be a shame. Oh, wow. Look at us now. <laughs> Shield charged. Oh, look at this. This is new stuff, too. Wow, that looks really cool, guy. It looks like a like a, a dock, you know, like a legitimate dock where there's like 
workers and stuff. Wow, man, people are so impressive. It's so crazy to me how impressive everyone is. Should be some wolves over here, right? Usually. Ah, I don't see any here. That's all right. Uh, and there was no clay there, so odds are the majority of all of the uh, resources up at the hills is probably gone. Oh, let's get some, let's get some periwinkle as well, since we want to make those flower boxes. Good. All right, got some periwinkle. Good stuff. Is this something that we want? No. Oh, those wolves better be careful. I'm coming for them. I'm coming for you wolves, jerk idiots. Oh, look, there's a home here now. Uh, or half of a home. <laughs> That's cool. I like what he's done with the stone columns. That looks really slick. Man, this is going to be such a cool server when everybody, you know, finishes what they're building. I like the huge chimney. That's kind of cool. Oh, I'm getting a little uh, shuddering on my on my screen here. wonder why that is. Hey, there is iron. Good stuff. Hopefully there's some flax around here, around these here parts. Uh, any flax? You got some flax for me, boys? Or some cotton. You take some cotton. All right, get us some iron. Some eye iron. You know what I mean? Oh, my goodness, some iron, you guys. Oh, my goodness. They're going to be so awesome. So I wonder how I'm gonna end up making like steel steel stuff like real real good chain mail or real good like plate armor even I would assume we're gonna need iron regular iron ore that's not impure so I would assume it's gonna take quite a bit of that right so we'll also have to venture out and find where uh, where some real iron is Flax for me ah you want to die you want to die fool bomb nice Wreck them without even trying. All right, should we try? Should we test our metal against this wolf here? You wanna fight? Come fight me. Nice. Oh, this is great. This is a much better way to fight. If I can block right. Nice. Ha <laughs> ha, that's awesome. Oh, we did take quite a bit of damage though, huh? Ooh, we might wanna start learning how to make health potions. I do know that Frixie is a uh, potion maker, an alchemist. So if any, if need be, we can always just call him and try to trade, trade for some Healy heals. I don't think we can take on three wolves at once right now, though. I think we need to get a little stronger before we start taking that kind of endeavor on. Oh, do you guys see that wall up there? Oh, wow, look at that. I'm so excited to go exploring. Just need to get our level up a little bit more before we start going out into the wild. All right, let's head back home, huh? Put this stuff inside of the, the kiln. Yeah. Man, nice, man. Man, nice, man. I'm just going to say man a bunch and say nice as well. Because, man, this is so nice. Uh, I don't remember what I did damage-wise with the sword. Shoot. Because I know we were doing, like, 17 or... Oh, what is this? Hops? Oh, that's good to know. Let's put this on the map. Good. Make sure to look around here for the... For the hops when we start brewing and stuff. Also, uh, Titus and his brother are making a uh, a tavern down the way, so I'm super excited. He said they're not they're they're not fully done just yet, um, and it's gonna be a little bit. But man, that that would be so freaking cool. I mean, could you imagine all of us just going and hanging out at a tavern? <laughs> that would be so freaking cool. That's why we need currency of some sort. Another cool thing that the devs should do is allow us to make roads. That would be so awesome. And it should be based off of like, sort of like a voting system. Like, so we would draw out a route for the roads and then everyone on the server would, uh, would you know, rate it one to 10 if they're willing to let this road creation become a thing. And then, you know, the one that's rated highest will get built. That would be so cool, right? Right, because then we could build a, you know, a whole road up and down this, like it's Main Street or something, you know? I don't know, I just thought that'd be a cool a cool idea, you know? Like this is pretty much Main Street that I'm running on and everybody uses right here as their main way of transportation up and down the, the area. Uh, look at our little quaint home, everybody. So beautiful. La Casa. All right, let's see how our charcoal kilns are doing. Huh? Let's get a couple, yeah, perfect. That's exactly what I was hoping for. All right, let's get us some coarse linen string, eh? Oh, you know what? Let's try to make one of these uh, cords real fast so we open up some uh, additional recipes, huh? You can do it. You can do it, make it. Go, get up there. Ah, dang it. You got this, come on, get up there. Yes, we did it. Okay, and we got ourselves something else. Coarse cotton cloth, wow. Nice, you guys. We're looking so good. All right, let's look around for some more stone here. Yeah? Is that what you think? You stupid boar? Watcha? Detracted. Not today, bud. Not today. Nice. Level up our uh, combat while we're searching for resources. Can I get this one? Wow, look at that. Sapwood and silver fir branch. Okay. Oh, 
Check out this new axe that uh, Titus gave me. Not too freaking shabby, huh? Oh, that's not what I was... We can hit these big, thick uh, trees now. Thick boys. Man, our neighbors are so cool. I just uh, talked to uh, Sixtus, which is the guy that made the... Uh, uh, made that house right there behind us. The, the really cool one that I want to learn how to make. And he said that uh, after you level up to a certain level, you get these uh, small, small wooden floors. And that's how he's made the uh, jut out on the top. So... We're just gonna keep grinding hard until we get those, until we get those, and once we get those, we're gonna go all in on a brand new design. We're going to fill this out properly. Everything's gonna be level and, and nice. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be awesome. I'm very excited for it. So I got heartwood, silver fur. Now, is that gonna make anything special though? Is that gonna make any special sort of deal or no? Nah? With a different type of wood in there? I don't know, we do need to put a bunch of stuff away though. Get some iron going, set up our thing. Look, we're, we're coming up big on the on the iron. Let's go and check what our other uh, charcoaler has. We are gonna move like all of our stuff outside, all of our, um, our crafting goodies outside. I really wanna emulate the crafting areas like he's got, it looks so freaking cool. So I guess what we'll wanna do is just build up our inventory of crafting doohickeys because once we get to those small wooden floors we're just gonna go hard i bet we can make really good uh bows with these silver fir branches i bet you money i bet you money that's exactly what you use it for let's go and knock down some more trees out there in the uh the wilderness hey like can i chop down this big old tree here oh sure enough i can no way that's got to give me tons right oh wow no more doing the little guys anymore which sounds wrong oh look at that you can oh it does the timber oh my gosh that is fantastic dude i'm so glad that's in the game 78 sap tree oh wow and it does the timber you guys what's this one this one looks different than the others what are you timber that's so awesome. Ah, I was worried I wasn't going to be able to do that. Look at this. Sapwood itself still. Okay. Cool, man. Oh, that one can't be cut. Why is that? Are you too big for my axe? No, this one's the same. Maybe that one's like stuck to the land. Can't be chopped down. I don't know. Nice. If I were to... Oh, next time we're going to fall underneath it. Or we're going to get underneath it and see if it hurts us when it falls. <laughs> Just for science. For carpentry science woodcuttery science that's amazing i haven't seen anybody chopping down these big trees so i'm so glad you can this is this is the coolest wow they did such a good job oh my gosh every minute that i play it blows my mind even further the depth and care that these guys show you gonna hurt me it did not hurt us okay good to know that's good to know for science all right let's take this stuff home eh Pick a home and start doing some stoof. Fine wooden planks, huh? Oh, fine wood beam. You don't say. Well, I got no more room, silly goose. All right, got some flower pots now. Look at that. Looking great. Can I stretch all... Oh, can't build there. Of course I can't, silly goob. Can I get up any higher? Can I get... Can I just reach up a little? Maybe if I go... There we go. Nope. I had it. Oh, that's hard to do. Nailed it. Freaking professional dudes. Guess let's just put them everywhere, I suppose. Maybe even on the front of this guy. Make it look pretty and such. Add a little depth to our building. Even though we are going to destroy it soon. Do not care. I want it to look nice until then. Look at it. It looks great. It looks so wonderful now. Which, yeah. Oh, wow. All of this is from our messed up ones. Oh, and they're just all sitting up here. Well, that's a flaw. That's not where we want those. That's, a uh, okay. So I've leveled up twice from before then. That's good. All right, got us some short wood stocks. Now let's go and make some goodies. Anything that gets us a recipe and anything that's hard, we're just going to do all those. Looks like we're going to need a lot of hinges soon. So we'll do that next, I believe, which works out well because we're doing lots of iron right now. Though we are supposed to be blacksmithing and such, but I want to get our house as squared away as possible and as permanent as possible. We'll still keep doing the weapon smithing and such. We did just put a forge over there on our outside, so that's good. So it's just about time for that. All right, we got some cloth linen, or coarse linen cloth. So since we do, and I need to make space in my inventory, what do I need for this? The coarse leather bands. That's right. Come here. Come here, you coarse leather band jerks. Ooh, that's all I got. Uh-oh. All right, that should be enough, right? Because we need four, four, eight, got it. We're making pants and a coif, a coif. I don't know how you say that word still, coif. Oh, we're dropping stuff all over the place. Of course we are. 
Very hard. So what? We're gonna get it. Do it. Get up there. Do it. Yes. There's one. There's one done. We did it. This one's a lot harder than the others. So I think we'll try to make seven of each if possible. <laughs> it's not looking too good. Oh no. Ah, dang it. Okay. Look at all this stuff on the ground. Dang it. Not even close. Come on. You're not even working. Put your back into it. Boy, that burns through your uh, your goods quite a bit, huh? Okay. Well, if that's how it is, maybe we don't do those. Is that is that not efficient? Seems like it might not be efficient to go that route. All right, here we go. Attempt number two for the quaffs. Darn it, and we failed miserab miserably. Miserably. <sighs> then we'll just make a bunch of uh, the shoes again. Get our level up a little bit more. We're wasting a lot of materials. Oh, wow, we're still getting 200 for those. So, yeah, why wasn't I doing these? Fool, what a fool. Ah, I wasted a bunch of materials. That's all right. Here, let's start trying to uh, get our forging up, huh? Let's see what we got to do over here. So, for an iron pommel, that's what we want, right? Right, right. And then, so we also want this. That'll need iron bars. Okay, we can make some iron bars real quick. All right, we'll make a few of these and then a few of the iron sword blades as well. Yeah. Oh, here's how you make the iron spike. Okay, nice. Okay, we can do this. We'll make 10 of these iron pommels. Probably want to make one of these guys as well. I think I remember seeing something for the iron knife blade somewhere. I forget exactly where. Hmm. Iron studs might be nice to do too. Leather studded gear, probably, right? Right? That's what it sounds like in my brain. All right, looks like we need to go and get some stoof, man. Time to go get some stoof. Got to run back over to that hillside, get us some more. Um, oh, look at this. This is new. Who's who's making this, I wonder? This is turned into an alleyway. Okay. Oh, what is this? That's pretty cool. Looks like it's all going to be one spot then, huh? I like it. I like it a lot. Nice. But yeah, we need to get some flax and some more iron um, and destroy any animals, large animals. Because so I think we need to get generic leather to make the generic leather string or the rough uh, leather string. And that is necessary for our weapon smithing. So let's do it. And we can always get more clay as well. That's always useful, especially when we have to rebuild our whole base into something that's more visibly pleasing to me. There we go, some old boars, huh? You wanna fight? Yes, line up, line up. Even file line, please. Yep, single file, I mean, not even. What are you doing behind that tree, dum dum? Oh, I'm behind the tree now. Sorry, guys. You will die, boar. Yes, yes, delicious, delicious. We will be eating a feast tonight of boar, old boar. It must taste better. Come here, dummies. Wah, wah, you will die, yes. Ah, perish, you fools. Rough animal hides, perfect. Sorry, wolf, I need to take your flax from you. You wanna fight? You wanna fight? You do wanna fight. Oh, it was just a fox. Yeah. It was a waste of our time, it was. Uh, looked like somebody was in need of assistance up here. I just saw someone get an attack. I'll save you, even though you're running away and totally fine. Not today, wolf. You will die here. Ugh. Come on, you can- Oh, jeez, man, he's putting up a fight. <laughs> you're dead. Jerk. Jerk bag. That's what you get. That's what you get for messing with my friends. Back to the grindstone, or grind iron, so to speak. <laughs> After we saved our friends, of course, like the hero we are. Look at us, <laughs> Viking heroes. <laughs> There's some flax. Okay, now we're ready for the iron broadswords. Let's do it. Make them. You can do this. It's hard, but you can do this. Got one little dabble of uh, luck. You can do it. A little a dabble do ya. <sighs> all right, all right. Second try for the win. We got this. Look at you go. Look at you go, Iron Broadsword. Oh my gosh, get up there. And that's one completed, boys and girls. We're on our way to weaponsmithing professional. Maybe we should spend some time making this blunt mace for a little bit. Get our level up. We're only at level two right now, weaponsmithing. So maybe, maybe it might be a good idea. Feels like we're just wasting a lot of materials. We did make one of them so far right two of them so far so you know it was a win in that regard but if we can't get two more then it would be a, a waste yep looking like a waste of materiales that's unfortunate ah uh, okay you know what so what do we need for the blunt mace just short wood stock iron ingots okay you know what? we'll do that next hey it looks like somebody's taking a quaff a coif i'll just put this on public let everybody get it honestly for right now we just need this stuff gone 
All right, here we go. So let's just make us a bunch of, oh, what is this? Very hard. We're not going to do that. We're just going to make a bunch of maces, 10 of them. Let's see where that gets us. Hopefully it gets us up to like level five, maybe 177 XP. Okay. Let's just try to make the, uh, the reinforced mace, I suppose. It's hard, but we'll see. Failed it. Get up there. Yeah. All right. That's much easier then. Nice, that was a good one. 243 XP for that. We'll, we'll get some long wood stocks then and just make some sturdy spears maybe. Get some sort of uh, some sort of XP going because, man, this is taking quite a bit. Ooh, a fine spear. That'd be nice. What's the difference between that and our spear? Ooh, the rustic is much more better. All right, we got four out of that. That's not too, too bad considering we only started with uh, enough for five, right? Didn't we? Oh, we still might be able to. We still have an iron spike, so let's give it a go. Get me up to level four, please. Get up there. Dang it. All right, you know what? Let's put some more burn eye down, I think is going to be a good idea for us because we need as many as we can get and we need more clay. <laughs> of course we do, you silly goober. Why don't you just assume that right off the bat? All right, come here, you idiots. Die, you fiends. Die, you. Okay, we're really losing out. All right, we should run. <laughs> Dang it, we died. <laughs> Dang it. I thought I was ready for the, the three pack and uh, <laughs> come to find out I was not. Well, you know what? We needed to get some clay anyway, so we might as well snag some. Well, you can summon your corpse to yourself. What? No corpse in range. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was going to say that's awesome. I wonder how far we have to be from our body to actually do that. Let's see. That's really good, though, in case, you know, you have a bunch of, like, a horde of beasts on top of you. You can snag it from far away. That's really cool. I didn't know that that was a thing. Okay, let's see from here. Oh, no. Are we gonna die again? Stop it. Go away. I'll be back for you, jerk bag. No corpse in range. Ah, but I'm right over there, aren't I? Ah, so how close do we have to be, I wonder? Our corpse should be right there. Oh, you see it from here. I can see it, so I should be able to grab it. Really? Okay, what about here now? I wish I would have known about this the first time that we died. That would have been really nice. Dang it. Oh, why didn't any of you guys tell me that you could summon your corpse to yourself? That's not very nice, you guys. I thought we were friends. Here they come. Dude, that has a cooldown on it. Of course it does. Oh, no. They got me. Ah, darn it. Dang it, dang it, dang it, man. All right, we're buffed up a little bit. Let's go get the rest of that clay. We've earned it. Nope, nope, dodged him. Dodged him. Ah, oh, dang it. I'm out of stamina. Oh, that's so not good. Come on, we can get across without dying. All right, so that wolf's down there now. You will die, wolf. Forget you, dude. Uh, uh, uh. Do I get points for my shield skill if I don't use the shield? That'd be good info to have. I feel like I probably shouldn't, right? Dang, there's two of them still. Here, after this healy heal, we should be able to go and wreck face. Once we get all the way up. Be cool if we had some sort of like throwables or something. Gotta get good at using that shield. He's taking he's taking damage really low. Oh, he's healing too. Look at that. No kidding. I didn't know they could heal. How are you healing? That was interesting. I've never seen them heal like that. That's I wonder what that was all about. He was eating the clay and getting its resources. He was a clay wolf. Alright, so since we got this clay, let's go up and kill all those boars up there. Come here, dum dums. Come over here and face my wrath. Let's go pick a fight with some of these uh, these other wolves up here for a minute just to get a little bit more skill under our belt. So is doing this, where I'm just letting him hit me for a long while, is this actually fixing our stats up a bit? Oh, can't can't go into tab while I'm fighting, dummy. All right, let's see. Let's see what that brought us up to. Hopefully almost a level three at that point. Oh, got it all the way up to level four. Okay, okay. Then that might be what we want to do all the flax here you know since we're here might as well grab it ah let's let's go back before we start getting in trouble let's run home before we get in trouble like i said all right so i just made some fine wood planks and it's showing a uh, a pottery kiln here what do we need for that oh some more rock real quick let's get some rock all right so i was just cutting some heartwood into the fine wood planks and um, because it's necessary for the pottery kiln here, which I think we're going to just throw it on down something like maybe a little more. Perfect. That seems awesome. So now what am I going to do with that exactly? Because the bricks, right? We want bricks, clay, and charcoal. Oh, dang, man. We're running out of charcoal, though. We need it for our blacksmithing duties. That's all right. We can go get some more clay. 
um, along the back side of the uh, the cliff over there real quick and then and then we'll we'll make a couple bricks I think would be a good idea all right let's see how these shingles and uh, shingles and bricks are made here huh so we'll craft that and we'll craft that it's gonna take 30 minutes I just wonder what that's gonna make for us though I'm really just doing it for these recipes right here I'm really hoping that the bricks will turn into those, the cobblestone, possibly? Probably not, though, huh? Because brick, anyway. I don't know. I don't know. Hopefully that opens something up for us. That'd be really swell. All right, so we've just spent some good time uh, collecting a bunch of wood for charcoal, as well as a bunch of iron for iron. And I think this guy is completed. Indeed it is. What do we do from here now? I've heard someone, uh, Skaldor on our uh, clan had said something about a mold. Nice, we got the walls. Stone wall foundations. Perfect. Nice. And we have the small wooden floors, too, so we can make something uh, that mirrors our friends over there. Ah, nice. Hopefully, uh, hopefully they agree to giving me this plot right back here. I think that would be really awesome, this plot right here. It's just sort of cutting off our, our flat land area and uh, making it hard for me to uh, design this how I want. So I had our buddy, our good friend, Titus ask Sixtus if uh, he'd be willing to just let me have that plot of land. So we'll see about it. We'll see about it. Hopefully so, because I, I have some pretty good ideas for a cool little building here. However, I'm going to call it here, folks. Thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out with me today. If you enjoyed this video, please take a moment and leave it a like. It really does help me out on YouTube and get more people to see these videos. If you have anything fun to talk about, tips or tricks, please leave them in the comment section below. And then if you want to see any more packs there, just more videos by me in general, please go to my YouTube, Notorious Crisco, hit the subscribe button, and then hit the bell icon. That way you're updated anytime that I post a new video. But thank you guys so much. I truly love you. I truly appreciate you. God bless you. And bye.